Saturday. Um, I think it's around 11.30, maybe almost noon. Haven't really been up to much today. I just ran out for a little bit this morning because I needed a couple things. School just started and I have a couple courses, so I might just take a look at those. I think I have two lectures to watch. And then I was going to clean out my Alex drawers, like my ones from Ikea, because they just are a huge disaster. I don't even know what's in them. I feel like I just keep throwing random crap in them. So I'm going to clean out those, see if there's anything I can get rid of or probably pass on to my sisters or my mom stuff that I don't use so I think that's what I'm gonna do today yeah just like a nice chill a nice chill Saturday I have a little bit of a headache again I feel like this is like my third one this week I don't know if I'm like stressed out about something and it's just making my head pound but I think I'm just going to take it easy today. We'll watch some Real Housewives while I clean. That sounds like an ideal day to me. Okay, so I'm about to tackle these drawers here. They're just such a disaster. I did have it all organized, like foundations and concealers and primers. That was what's supposed to be in this drawer. And then in here was supposed to be like bronzers and blush and my palettes and everything else. But that also is just, it's supposed to be like skincare, but it's just, again, just a random mixture of everything. And then hair stuff. And yeah, it's just like everything in both of these, like from the top to the bottom. It's just chaos. Even up here, I feel like I need to go through like those acrylic organizers and that one back there and just figure out the stuff that I use and the stuff that I just don't use anymore because I just feel like I have so much stuff. Because this too, this guy right here also is filled with makeup and brushes so I think after I organize all of this I'm going to also clean my brushes because they desperately need to be cleaned this is from like before when I used to always paint my nails but now I get them done so like I don't even use any of these I'll probably just keep a couple colors for like when I paint my toes but honestly other than that I'm probably going to give them to my mom or my sisters or see if someone else wants them i got my little candle burning this is a summer one i believe get some fall stuff but i haven't made it there yet but i will make it there soon because i cannot wait to get some fall candles and i just need like the smells of fall i'm going to start tackling everything here and we will see what kind of progress I make today. Oh, like my paws have been all over everything. If I can clean that off. But yeah, we are going to tackle this disaster. starting today off in the car um I woke up so like congested this morning I feel like it's that time of the year when like the seasons are changing where my allergies just don't know what to do with themselves and they just like to make an appearance I don't have them all year round but they get bad when like it's like 
the beginning of September, so some days are still hot, but then other days they're, it's a little bit chilly, so my sinuses are just all over the place. And I woke up with these like tiny red bumps on my lips. I don't know if you can see them, but I don't know what's going on there. Kind of a hot mess this morning. Go get a tea. I'm feeling a tea. Maybe it'll calm whatever's going on down, but yeah, I just thought maybe some new scenery this morning, so we will start off in the car, and yeah. I'm not sure what I'll be getting up to today, but I'd like to breathe first. Also, I like scratching myself with my own nail, and now I have a little cut on my head. Oh, I need to get my life together. I just posted my vlog this morning, my one from this, well, I guess last week, but I found it was so much easier as I was filming the clips this time like that night I edited them so it was so much easier that I didn't have to sit there for like an hour or so and edit on Saturday so that was kind of nice I feel like I'm going to keep doing that just took a lot of like just doing those little things made it so much easier that I could just like put it all together and yesterday morning I already had it uploaded and then I just put it to public today so I feel like the process was a lot faster and a lot easier because I sometimes dread editing when I know I have like a long video and this vlog I think ended up being like 27 minutes. I'm shocked I even have that much footage because honestly I don't even remember what I do during the week so kind of like a little recap for me also. I forgot to show you guys what I actually accomplished. I did tidy up these drawers here. Um, this is still kind of a little chaotic, but like, <laughs> kind of organized. I just have a lot of foundations and I thought of putting them in like, um, one of the deeper drawers, but I don't know. I feel like it's hard to keep them organized anyway, so... I just have them all in here and I have some extras like along here and just primers right here and my concealers are over here and my setting powders are just in the back and then I cleaned up this one too so I just did like highlighters and blush back here bronzers and then these are just like mascaras eyeliners <clears throat> stuff like that and my foundations to like one of these like deeper drawers but I just like to have my stuff in order like I do like the base of my makeup here and then it goes here and then this is like my eye drawer so I just left them up top it's hard to really keep them exactly like organized but and these are like just my palettes and like these bigger like box ones back here the rest of my palettes and then i have some like loose eyeshadows and then i just have some lip products here the rest of my lip products are just like up in here which i said i was going to clean but i didn't so i'll have to tackle that next and then in here i just organize like all my skincare, so just like masks are in this like little basket. I think I got all of these two at the dollar store. So super cheap. They're gonna get dirty anyway, so I wasn't gonna spend too much money on them. Um, other face masks here like that are in jars, moisturizers, makeup remover wipes, and then I just have all of like my face masks and eye masks down here. And then here I just have my hair stuff, so like all my hair tools, um, my millions of bottles of dry shampoo, and hairspray actually too. And then just some hair masks, and that just needs to go in the garbage because it's from these drawers. But this one I actually really am proud of myself, I got rid of a lot of nail polish. If you remember when, I think I did a clip of this one, but... It was like back to here with just nail polish. I'm gonna keep a couple for when I like 
painted my toenails, but as you can see, I just, I just needed more than a couple. So this, that's what's in here, but I did definitely declutter the nail polish, which I am proud of myself for. And then that's just like hair dye, razors, random stuff like that. And then as we go down, they're just like not very exciting. Yeah, that's what I got accomplished. Nothing <laughs> too, like I feel like I could have done more. As the drawers get down towards the bottom, they're not very exciting. And it's just like lotions and stuff like that, which is kind of hard to like make them look nice and neat because they're just weird shaped, but looking real good right now. But I did that Saturday and it's Monday today. I started watching this show. It's on Hey You, I think that's how you pronounce it. I really don't know. It's just H A why you and it's just full of like reality shows which are like my jam so it's per excuse me bird perfect for me because i just love reality tv like all the housewives and that that's my shit but i started watching this show it's called dating no filter if you guys subscribe to like that hey you you definitely should watch it because it's so so funny Watching people on first dates is the best thing ever. And I think there's like, there's always new episodes. So I think it is on regular TV too. I'm not sure what channel, but I highly recommend checking it out because it's so, so funny. But I'm probably just going to watch that for a bit and do some schoolwork. I was up super early for work this morning and I'm just feeling beat so probably gonna do some boring schoolwork and then oh yes also I want to update you on the turkeys in the neighborhood <laughs> they're literally still bobbing around I don't know where they're living like I've seen these wild turkeys before um, I think up by like the golf course I've seen them and like off of the highway I've seen them in like just a big field but I've never seen them actually like in town like hanging out in the neighborhoods but these three are still around they just came out earlier of the neighbor's yard and they're bopping around so they're kind of like disrupting the neighborhood but like I'm kind of loving it it's so funny and what else am I gonna say and the countdown is on until my little mini vacation i think i'm at like 10 days till i go so i'm excited for that i'm excited to get away um to see my boyfriend that'll be nice so yeah it's a lot of things to look forward to like i feel like i've said before i'll probably vlog the trip this is like the first time i've like traveled by myself so we'll see how that goes hopefully I know what I'm doing. It's just on the way there, on the way back, I'll be with him, so it won't be too, too bad, but my flight leaves super early in the morning next, next week, so I think my plane leaves at like 6 a.m., so that will be super fun to be up that early and at the airport. All I'm hoping since it's so early it won't be too busy and perhaps like my flight won't be so full so i won't be stuck beside someone it's only like a 40 45 minute flight from london to toronto so i didn't pick my seat for that flight because i thought whatever it's one of those like tiny planes anyway so wherever i was wherever i'm gonna have to sit anyway i'm not gonna be comfortable so but for Toronto to Saskatoon it's like three and a half four hours I definitely picked my seat for that flight because when you're tall it's just like you just have no leg room whatsoever and it's so uncomfortable so I felt bougie and I paid extra to pick my seat but I'm 
very happy with that decision and I'm just like rambling on I'll stop now I'm gonna go back and watch the show for a little bit before I have to be responsible and do fun schoolwork mm -hmm. She's just down for whatever. Right she makes you want to smile, you know? Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh my god. <laughs> that is uncommon. <laughs> Quality <laughs> content. You finish here? Absolutely. Hello guys. Just thought I would check in today. It's Wednesday. Yeah, it's Wednesday or 11.30. I haven't really been up too much today. I think I'm just going to wash the dishes. Super fun. I'll do the dishes and then I need to shower. I still have like makeup under my eyes. Just looking like a real treat today. Yeah, I just thought I would check in. I know I haven't vlogged since Sunday, I think. I think I did a little bit Sunday, but yeah, I just worked the past two days, so again, nothing, there was nothing to really film, because I've been trying to stay home and not spend money. There hasn't been any recent visits to the mall, which seems very rare for me, so yeah, I'm trying to be more responsible and not basically buy shit that I don't need so we'll probably just I'm off today and tomorrow so I would just spend the next couple days at home trying to keep myself busy actually I do have stuff to do like I have some lectures to watch but like I just don't feel like doing it but I know I have to, but it'll force me to actually get some stuff done. I'm just going to quickly clean up this and then I need to take a shower because you guys can, I'm sure, just tell. I like forgot to take my makeup off last night. I know, very, very bad. But sometimes I'm just, you know when you're already in bed and you just can't be bothered to like get back out? That's what happened to me. Oh, I'm really happy that that person stopped cutting the grass when I'm done talking. I know I look terrifying right now. I just put this on because it's so much easier to wash these masks off. You can even see me. To wash these masks off, like in the shower. Oh, yes, living. I'm saying it's so much easier door it's so much easier to wash these off in the shower I find it's never like you know those like face wash commercials where like they're just like splashing the water at their face like that's not real life I try to do that and it's like a freaking tsunami all over the bathroom sink so I don't even attempt it I find that it's much easier if I just do it before I hop in the shower and then when I'm in there it's so much easier to just like wash it off and like if you make a mess who really cares oh let me set you down for a sec so so hot out today like it's September I'm ready for the cool weather like Saturday it was so cool and so nice and that's what I that's the weather that I just thrive in so I can't handle this heat so I'm inside I just had to put the air back on because I was dying plus I did my little cleaning and I swept the floors because I just I don't know if anyone else just loses so so much hair all the time so I feel like this glob is just gonna like roll off my face but like I was saying I lose so much hair like so much like I have a lot of hair on my head, like she's real thick and I lose so much hair that I'm shocked I even have any 
like I still have so much left on my head like I swept up so much hair earlier like I could make a dog out of it basically like a tiny dog and I just touched my face that I just whatever. oh my god that's so much better I feel like I need to <laughs> do this whole spiel all over again but I don't really want to who knew that that's all I needed to do was wipe off the lens it's getting this everywhere but like I said I'm just going to hop in the shower wash this off I desperately need to wash all this freaking hair like I hate hair washing days like honestly every time I shower I don't wash my hair every single time because it's just a lot plus it's not good to wash your hair every single time so I try to wash it like twice twice a week but yeah like I was saying I I just swept up so much hair it was like absolutely ridiculous before I go I feel like this time of the year all the time I'm always debating chopping my hair off oh excuse me I feel like at this time of the year I'm always debating if I should chop my hair off or not I think it's down to about like my boobs right now and usually I let it like I'll just let it grow long and then I go and get it chopped and just let it grow back again so it's nice and healthy but I don't know like a part of me wants to keep it long but then there's like that I like that tiny tiny itch where I really want to chop it off I don't know you guys have to tell me what you think I mean I feel like it would make more sense if I chopped it off for summer because that's when it's hot rather than when it starts to get cold and I'm gonna need the extra layer of warmth from all this hair but yeah I'm struggling I kind of want to chop it off but I kind of want to just keep letting it grow maybe I'll just go get like a trim I don't know either way I do need some sort of trim going on because I have to get it. I need to always get it thinned out you know like some long layers just to make it a little bit just so it's not like one straight line I guess if that makes sense but right now my layers are funky and grown out so like honestly I feel like when my hair is down I kind of get like shade to anyone that has a mullet but I feel like I kind of get some mullet vibes sometimes when my hair is a certain way right now but yeah that's my dilemma this is just gonna roll right down just got out of the shower I feel like nice and refreshed I did a hair mask too which I feel like I desperately needed I can already see that my scalp's getting like super dry and it hasn't even gotten cold yet so that's annoying but I'll show you guys the mask I did this was this guy right here it's the Garnier whole blends this one's the avocado oil and shea butter so like this I actually emptied it garbage it goes great angle that was okay I literally washed my face and it still looks like I have like mascara on but I also use this guy it's the Garnier skin active it's soothing cleansing milk um, I found this is really good if you have sensitive skin especially after I washed that mask off I could feel like the redness and it almost felt not that I was burning but I could definitely feel my skin like tingling so this was nice it just kind of like takes the sting out like it kind of just soothes it after I use a mask or something because I do have like my skin is a little bit more on the sensitive side or scrub because I just have a lot of dry skin right now and it was nice to just like get in there and like scrub it off and my face looks really red right now but and then I just put on some moisturizer so that was that I was gonna film a video today but I'm thinking 
Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. Actually, I want to see if I can be really good and get two videos filmed tomorrow while I'm like while I have some time off. And I want something too that I can upload when I am out of town. Besides just the vlogs, I feel like lately I've just been uploading vlogs even though there's just like only there's only three and I did like two in a row but I really want to keep doing other videos too but since like work and school it's just I need to find a nice like balance between finding time to like get other things done but I'm hoping tomorrow I can do two videos Friday I have an overnight shift so I don't go until 11.30 at night so maybe with my day Friday like during the day I can also get another one done so it was nice to be have that literally made no sense it would be nice to have three videos ready to go up when I want to upload them so that's the goal and then if I write stuff down in like my planner or like organize myself that I'm more likely to get shit done basically so I'm gonna go do that now with some interesting video ideas do a little brainstorming that's what I'll do for the afternoon I'm like boiling right now like boiling Wait, once this hair dries I'll tackle this I did want to film today but I also knew oh hello but I also knew that I had to really wash my hair so and that's like a day process to like let it dry straighten it and then like curl it if I want to so I'm gonna wait for tomorrow and Friday to film when I can get this hair looking good got a big old storm happening the shit out of me. Can't even see because it's raining so hard. Trying to start my vlog in this parking lot, but there's people everywhere. Everywhere. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh, what do you girls think of this? <laughs> Our dad bought us a vehicle, so it's okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Interrupting a present. <laughs> Who's is that? Yeah. Happy birthday. That's not mine. Who's this? Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Basement to look for my suitcase. Oh, where is it? Oh. He's way back there. It's 
in there. Oh. Hey guys, I feel like I haven't checked in in a while. It's Friday night. Um, it's just after 10. I actually have to work at 11.30 tonight. I worked until 8 tomorrow morning, so I just wanted to hop on here because, well, I'll end this vlog right now because I'm going to start a new one tomorrow, probably afternoon when I get up because I definitely need to sleep when I get home from work tomorrow. So we have a long overnight shift tonight, but trying to get away from this light. Uh, what else am I going to say? Earlier, I was out at my parents for celebrating my little sister's 18th birthday. And also, they surprised her with a new car, which I do have footage of. Either you'll see it before this end clip, or I'll put it in after I am do my little rambling. But yeah, that was good. And I think that's all I have to say. I think I need to take off all of this makeup because I've had it on for already like seven hours and I don't want to sit at work with it on and have it on for like 15, 16 hours because the skin needs to breathe. So I'm going to take off all of this makeup, try to like have a little bit of a nap before just so I don't get too tired tonight, but the nap was a fail, so that didn't happen. So hopefully I have the energy to get through. I'll just have to get a big coffee before I go in. Like I said, I'm going to start a new vlog tomorrow. I was unsure if I was gonna start it tomorrow and just go all the way like through to me traveling because I leave next Friday. But I'm thinking maybe I'll just start a new one tomorrow and then do tomorrow to Thursday, which will be the 19th. And then I'll start a new one on Friday, like when I actually fly out. So maybe that's what I'll do. So maybe we'll have like, I'll have two vlogs that'll go up after this, like one after the other. But yeah, like I said just mentally preparing myself for this night shift um going to take off my face put on something comfy as if I'm not already in my pajamas but I need to change and I can't remember what was in this vlog I don't even know what I did this week not much I don't think because I'm trying to be responsible and not spend money so I didn't really leave the house aside from to go to work Thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe also you can follow me on my other social media too I will put it at the bottom of the screen if I remember but that is always down in the description box too but yeah thank you guys for watching and I will see you in my next video peace